Hey, it's Libby Mishana. Welcome back to my channel. If today is your first time here, welcome. I'm glad you're here. I would love for you to join the family, so make sure to hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss any of my upcoming videos. So in today's video, I'm going to transform these baskets. I got these from Goodwill and I'm going to be using these for uh, my flower girls for the wedding. I have four flower girls, so I'm going to be transforming these. So if you want to see how I went from this to this, let's get started. I went to Goodwill and I wasn't able to find the same baskets more than twice. Um, these were the two that I found that were the same. If you're going for a rusty look, you can actually use these like that. But I'm not going for a rusty look. So these ones were $2.99. This is about $6. This one was my favorite because it was obviously the cheapest. This was a yellow. So I paid 99 cents for this. And this one was my most expensive one, was $3.99. If I found a different one, I wouldn't have taken this, but everything else was either way more smaller or bigger. So I ended up taking this one. This looks like it had, someone had probably like put something in there. So I'm gonna have to remove that, probably with like water or something like that, I'm not really sure. I might not even need to do that, but they're very beautiful baskets. I really love them, well made. Even though it comes from the thrift store, it's not broken apart. It's very good. As you can see, the baskets are very well made. They're still good. They're not broken. This is the only one that has less of a really good looking shape at this moment. So this one looks a little bit older for sure, as you can see, but it's still together. Things are not broken, so I'm still going to use that. And I'm gonna remove whatever is in here as well. I think they probably like glued flowers or something in there. I'm not really sure. So for this first part of the project, of course, I also went ahead and grabbed two of these ultra matte white paints. So I'm gonna spray paint them and see how they turn out. Here is the color I'm using to spray paint my baskets. So let's go ahead and spray paint. A few days after, I finally got the time to get to work with this. So, what we need for the second part is some glue sticks. I have my glue gun here and it's already getting warm. I have these flowers that I got from the dollar store. I have a few ribbons that I had at home and I'm just going to see if I might need it. So let's get started. Let me show you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna just go fast and just show you what the idea is. This is my inspiration for what I'm trying to do. 